Estrecho de Bolvo Negro is located in the municipality of Moratalla in the Murcia region of southern Spain. This area is known for its natural beauty and geological significance. Estrecho de Bolvo Negro is a river gorge carved out by the Rio Aljarabe, a small river that flows through limestone cliffs, forming beautiful natural pools, small waterfall. It is a popular spot for hiking and nature exploration, especially due to its pristine wild surroundings. Above Estrecho de Bolvo Negro, there are remains of a settlement from the Iberian culture, which inhabited this part of Spain before the Roman invasion. The Iberian tribes in this area were part of a civilization that existed from around the 6th century BCE until the Roman conquest in the 1st century BCE. The Iberians often built their settlements on hilltops to protect themselves from intruders and to maintain a strategic view of the landscape. I saw a turtle. The ruin is likely the remains of a defensive structure or fortified village, typical of Iberian societies. Such settlements were usually surrounded by walls or stone barriers and contained houses made of stone or clay. This settlement above Estrecho de Bolvo Negro may have served as a strategic lookout and defense against potential enemies. Estrecho de Bolvo Negro. While also allowing the Iberians to control the surrounding river area and its resources, such as water and agricultural land. The site is an important archaeological find, providing insight into how Iberian people lived, organized themselves, and defended themselves in the rugged, mountainous terrain of what is now the Murcia region. The geology of the area around Estrecho de Bolvonegro is fascinating and has been shaped by natural processes over millions of years. The area is dominated by limestone, a sedimentary rock formed from deposits of marine organisms in shallow seas during the Jurassic period around 150 million years ago. Over time, tectonic processes lifted the seabed, forming the mountains of today's Sierra de Moratalla. Limestone is particularly susceptible to a process called chemical weathering, in which acidic rainwater reacts with calcium carbonate, the main component of limestone, gradually dissolving the rock. This phenomenon is responsible for creating many of the unique features seen in the Estrecho de Bolvo Negro, including gorges, caves, and river channels. Over millions of years, rain and rivers have carved through limestone layers, creating deep ravines and gorges. The Rio Aljarabe, which flows through the gorge, has played a crucial role in this process. The continuous flow of the river has eroded the limestone and over time, the water has carved out the narrow dramatic valley that forms the Estrecho de Bolvo Negro. This is an excellent example of fluvial erosion, where rivers shape the landscape by carrying away loose material detached by the current. Due to the high concentration of limestone in the area, a karst landscape is a prominent feature in the Estrecho de Bolvo Negro. A karst landscape is characterized by underground rivers, caves, and sinkholes that form as a result of water dissolving the limestone. In the area, there are several small caves and cavities created by this process. The area's erosion is also influenced by climatic factors. The Murcia region has a Mediterranean climate with hot, dry summers and mild winters, but it can also experience heavy rain, especially in autumn when torrents, sudden and intense rainfalls, cause high river flows in rivers like the Rio Aljarabe. These high flow events can rapidly erode riverbanks and further shape the valley. During dry periods, the river's erosive power is reduced, but the continuous interaction between water and limestone continues on a smaller scale. The river also transports sediments that can vary from small clay particles to larger stones, depending on the water flow. These sediments settle in calm pools or along the riverbanks, creating beautiful natural pools like those seen in the Estrecho de Bolvo Negro. Over time, these sediments contribute to shaping the riverbed, while the gorge gradually widens due to ongoing erosion. Together, these geological and erosional processes give the area its dramatic topography and characteristic beauty, where the power of nature is visible in every detail of the landscape. Look how beautiful it is. It gets more and more beautiful and extreme as we get to the end. I had to really search for the most spectacular places and I have not seen all there is to see yet. I will come back to this amazing place maybe when the water level is different Anyways, this area is full of places to explore, so I will be back soon. I saw a lot of turtles, but they are difficult to film. It's hard to film how nice it really is here, but the further you go, the more spectacular it becomes.
I am happy that you have watched this far. Please watch my other videos of places that I like.